First of all, I think it's a it's a very difficult game to play. Actually, it's a brutal game to play. Um, you know, nobody really, really feels like playing. I think I've been in this thing so many times right now. They need to name it after me. And uh, but it's uh, I, I give our guys a lot of credit because it is it, it comes down to a pride game, and it comes down to a game. You know, we, we play a lot of guys that don't see a lot of ice time during the regular season. We play a lot of guys that are down in numbers or games or have played minimal minutes, guys that are going to come back and we feel like they're big parts of our team down the line. It's an opportunity for us to, to give seniors you know, a last opportunity to wear the uniform and we want to send those guys out well. So I, I was particularly proud that tonight as I have been in the past the way our guys have responded and played uh, for those guys that, that, that you know, will always be part of the program but no longer part of the team. Uh, it's good to see those guys go out with their wins. So I was very happy with the effort. I was really proud of the team. Not only tonight, but throughout the whole season. To, to be where they are today from where they came from is quite an accomplishment. It speaks a lot about the organization. Derek, can you describe the play that led to Tyler's goal? Well, I just, uh, I think it was off the face off. Um, actually, no, the puck got uh, dumped in the corner. And he got beat my guy down to it. And, um, you know, I just wanted to hard wrap it, take it away from you know the pressure. And, uh, you know, Tyler was telling me after the game he just kind of went as hard as he could, and you know we got a fortunate bounce, and, and he picked it up and went down, and, and was able to put it in. So I was definitely uh, definitely happy to see that go in. Next question. Uh, this is to any of the players. Um, um, did you get a sense as the game progressed that it was going to be increasingly more difficult to solve? To Chad Johnson, maybe one more time. Um, I guess I'll answer this one. It's Ron Wilton. He's just a, he's obviously the player of the year in the CCHA and we knew going into the game that if he played it wasn't going to be easy to score. And uh, just watching him in the end, it's, it's, uh, it's uh, quite remarkable. He's just so big and compact and he, he looks very calm on every shot. So when the goalie looks calm on every shot, you know it's going to be a tough time. I can tell you from a coach's perspective, as the game went on, I thought it was going to be really hard to score on Derek Jansen. Seriously. Any other questions? Derek, I'll follow up on Coach's comment. Uh, well, how are you feeling out there? What was uh, going on for you that made this way you the tonight? Well, um, I think the main thing was uh, I really uh, went to bed last night preparing for this game because I wanted to send these guys out on a good note, the five seniors. I'm very close. I'm roommates with two of them and very close with the other three. So. Derek, you know, Derek. Derek is actually in that class. He's a fifth year guy. He's been here in Belgium, so he's one of his classmates. Yeah, pretty much. I just uh, wanted to win for them. And, and as the game went on, it got easier and easier. And that part kept looking bigger than me. So. Any other questions? Been great. I mean, obviously, this is uh, a pretty special experience, uh, especially as a freshman. I mean, uh, we didn't we didn't start the season off too strong, even with uh, high expectations. But uh, when we all came back after Christmas, I think we all kind of had a hunger to win. You know, we kind of all felt like we had more in the tank than we've been performing. So hopefully, uh, I mean, next year we can start winning right from the beginning. And Make this experience even a better one. Any final question? 